Today we're going to talk about Google Webmaster Tools. These are tools that allow you to see how Google sees your website. It contains information that you can't get anywhere else. Start by searching for Google Webmaster Tools. You can log into Webmaster Tools with your Google account. If you don't have a Google account, you can create a Google account. You start at your dashboard. This is where you would type in the name of the site that you want to add to your Webmaster Tools dashboard. I'm going to use one of the personal blogs that I have. And then click Add Site. The first thing it tells you is that you need to verify your site. Click on the link. You have two options for site verification. You can add a meta tag to the site or you can upload an HTML file. I'm going to choose add a meta tag. Here Google tells you the meta tag information that you need to put on the home page of the site that you're adding to Google Webmaster Tools. I'm going to highlight this and use Control C to copy it. I've added this meta tag to the header section of the home page of the site I'm trying to verify and now I will click the verify button. I've successfully verified the site I'm interested in. Because this is a new site, no pages from the site have yet been included in Google's index, nor have I yet completed a site map. That's the next step I'm going to do. This site is a blogger.com blog. Through the blogger help files, I found out what code needs to be added here to create a sitemap from the blog file. The sitemap has now been added. One of the most important pieces of information that you can get from Google Webmaster Tools that you can't get any other place is information on links. By clicking here, Pages with External Links, Google will give you information on the number of external links found to your website. This is very important information when you're doing link building, both to find out who already links to your site and to find out whether the people that you've requested link to you actually do. An example of how this information is different than what you can get any other place can be shown by looking at my regular business website. If I go to the links page and choose pages with external links, it tells me that there are a total of 309 external links to my website currently. However, if I go over to Google and use the link command, link 
colon www.askjoanne.com. Google only reports 23 sites linking to askjoanne.com. So this gives you a very good idea of the fact that by using Google Webmaster Tools you can get a lot more detailed information than you can by just doing a link search at google.com. There's a lot more information available in Google Webmaster Tools, but this is the basic information that I want you to be aware of, that you can find out the exact number of links to your website from other websites, and by clicking on any of the numbers, you can get all the detail of who those other sites are. Thanks so much for listening. And if you have any questions at all, please contact me through my website at www.askjoanne.com. Info at askjoanne.com is my email address and my telephone is 203-364-0222. Thanks for listening and have a great day.